Hello guys welcome to my YouTube channel today we'll see Saudi Aramco questions for welding inspector part 2. Question 1. Duties of welding inspector? Answer, there are three stages of duties as follows. Before welding. Joint fit up inspection, root gap, bevel angle etc. Welder ID card. Calibration of welding machine and ovens. Base metal, thickness. During welding. Welding parameters like current, volt and travel speed. Gas flow rate. 3. Welding process must be verified. 4. Consumable brand. 5. Interpass temperature measurement. After welding. 1. Weld visual inspection. 2. NEPWHD requirement. Question 2. What is WPS? Answer. WPS is stands for Welding Procedure Specification. It is a written document which provides the direction to the person applying the material joining process. Question 3. What is PQR? Answer. PQR is stands for Procedure Qualification Record. PQR is record of variables recorded during the welding of test coupon and to fulfill the required mechanical properties. Question 4. Difference between WPS and PQR? Answer. WPS contains the qualification ranges and PQR contains the actual value recorded during welding of test coupon. Question 5. What is essential variable? Answer. A change in a welding condition which will affect on mechanical properties of weldment and it shall require requalification of WPS. Example, P number, PWHT, F number and preheat. Question 6. What is non-essential variable? Answer, a change in a welding condition which will not affect on mechanical properties of weldment and changes may be made without requalification of WPS. Example, groove design, root gap, electrode diameter. Question 7. What is supplementary variable? Answer, a change in a welding condition which will affect the notch, toughness properties of the weldment. In this condition supplementary essential become as additional essential variable. Question 8. What is polarity? Answer. Polarity is determined whether the most of the arc energy is concentrated at the electrode surface or surface of the parent material. Question 9. What is straight polarity? Answer. When the electrode is connected to the negative terminal of the power source. Question 10. What is reverse polarity? Answer. When the electrode is connected to the positive terminal of the power source. Question 11. Define low hydrogen electrode? Answer. Electrodes which contain hydrogen level less than or equal to 8 milliliters slash 100 grams of deposited weld metal. Measured accordance with AWS of 4.3. Question 12. Explain E. 7018? Answer. E. Electrode. 70. Minimum tensile strength. KSI. 70,000. Minimum tensile strength. PSI, 1, welding position, 8, type of coating and current characteristics. Question 13. Explain E, 70S6. Answer, ER electrode rod, 70, minimum tensile strength, KSI, S, solid bare wire, 6, chemical composition. Question 14. Define SATIP, SATR, SAEs and SAEP. Answer, SATIP. Saudi Aramco Typical Inspection Plan. Citra, Saudi Aramco Test Report. SAEs, Saudi Aramco Engineering Specification. SAEP, Saudi Aramco. Question 15. Thickness Limitation for Procedure Qualification? If a welder deposits weld metal of thickness 13 mm or more, with a minimum of 3 layers, then he or she qualifies for an unlimited thickness. Please refer ask me Section 9QW451.1. Question 16. Thickness limitation for performance qualification? Please refer ask me section 9QW452.1A. Please subscribe and share with friends. Question 17. If welder qualified in 1.5 inch pipe diameter then what is his qualified range? Answer. From 1 inch to unlimited diameter. Please refer ASME Section 9QW452.3. Question 18. 
what is P number and why it assigned? Answer, P number is assigned for base metals to reduce number of welding procedure. Question 19. What is F number? Answer, F number is grouping of electrodes and welding rods. F number is fundamentally determines the ability of welders to make satisfactory welds with a given filler metal. Question 20. What is SFA number? Answer, dash SFA number is an ASME specification. Example, steel and steel alloys, aluminum and aluminum alloys, etc. Question 21. What is a number? Answer, a number is identified of weld metal chemical composition or weld metal analysis. Question 22. For what diameter GTAW process shall be used for all passive weld? Answer, the GTAW process shall be used for all passes for butt welds and socket welds in piping and nozzles less than 33.4 mm outside diameter 1 inch NPS. This does not apply to weld olets, sock olets, thread olets and welding bosses. Question 23. If welder qualified in 3G, then can he qualified to weld on pipe? Answer, yes he can able to weld as flat and vertical position per pipe over 24 inches inch diameter. And also able to weld in flat position per pipe less than or equal to 24 inches inch diameter. Question 24. What is the time limit for welder expiration? Answer, no greater than 6 months from the date of qualification. Question 25. What is the time period for welder renewal and what are the tests are required for renewal? Answer, welder renewal time period is within 6 months with below requirements, a. Welder shall have passed mechanical and visual examinations. b. Alternatively welder may be qualified by volumetric NDE. c. Renewal of qualification may be done on production work. Please subscribe and share with friends.